right, so um, if you put your hands together, we will bring out Mean Mary. Thank y'all so much. It's great to be here. I'm so happy that I've, I've made it to St. Louis. And, uh, and, you know, I see folks in the front row. Usually they hear the name Mean Mary, and the front row is always empty. So I'm really, really. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's all right. Yes, because. Uh, if any of y'all have been to my, my shows, you know that there's a, that the rule is that the front row has to dance to the first fiddle song of the evening, so it's a tradition, so what can I say? <laughs> well, we'll figure this out. I'm going to get my banjo tuned up here a little bit. looks like it's decided to, as all banjos like to do, stay out of tune 99% of the time. I like to do one of my Sugar Creek songs, so I'm going to do just uh, the first one here. This is Sugar Creek Mountain, one that I wrote with my mom. Oh, I get handsome, stands a peak, stands a mountain of Sugar Creek, all the sassy bees and sexy knees and possums swinging on sycamore trees. You can sit and stare at nothing in particular, sit and dream, but life's perpendicular, sky and trees and rocks and granite up and down and all around. The hum little girls who don't see do around Sugar Creek Mountain and don't slow. Four steps back and better keep counting your step off old Sugar Creek Mountain. And if you push and shove, just promenade the one you love Oh, by Jew and oh, by G, don't look at her when you dance with me Dive in the middle, don't shove a push, keep going round the mulberry bush Oh, by gosh and oh, by Jew, this may be the last time I don't know Young little girls in O.C. do around Sugar Creek Mountain and don't slow Four steps back and better keep counting your step up old Sugar Creek Woo. Mountain I have a train song and I have a barn song and I have a tractor song, so I thought I'd I thought I'd start with the tractor song tonight. Do you have any uh, folks that uh, own tractors out there? Of course, on the front row. <laughs> Anybody else out there? Okay, we got a few. Anybody got an antique tractor? Of course. <laughs> And the rest of y'all love tractors, right? You just, yeah. Of course. Well, awesome. This is a, this is a little tune called the Trumbull County Antique Tractor Show.
my brain. Six of people struck a seal, can't get seal, never feel it. Drug me near insane. It was air in the air, and a stare in a stare, like a lonesome bird of prey. Like a quail singing higher on the fire with his iron. so much. I couldn't see, but y'all got up and danced, right? Okay. Just checking. What's that? Just the front row. <laughs> well, awesome. we'll get the rest of y'all on the next, uh, next song or two. I'm going to do, uh, well, I'm tuned up here in G. I'm going to do a little gospel song that I wrote last, um, Last, uh, oh gosh, I guess not last year now. It's uh, Well, during the uh, pandemic, I uh, recorded an album called Alone, fittingly, and uh, this was one of the songs on it. And uh, it, was, uh, it was fun to do because usually as a, as a multi-instrumentalist and I record, I, I have the tendency to want to like, I got to do this, and then I'm going to do banjo, I'm going to put fiddle, and I'm going to harmonize, you know, you know, all these different hats, you know, you want to wear. But uh, I decided to do an album that was just kind of like what you hear today, just vocal and one instrument at a time. So, uh, so this is one we wrote for that. I wrote with my mom. I said tomorrow, the Lord said today. Oh, what about today? Is this my final trouble? Has it come and gone? The Lord answered softly, there's another coming on. Will it come tomorrow? Can't I hide away? He said, you could stand and face it all. It could come today. Oh, I said tomorrow. The Lord said today. He said, you can do better. You can be right now and pray. I said tomorrow. He said, tomorrow's God. 
about tomorrow, Lord? And he said, what about today? my help again but right now I can't delay maybe later on this week does it have to be today God said later is a travesty you could wait your life away tomorrow may not happen but what about today oh, I said tomorrow the Lord said today he said you can do better you can do right now and pray I said tomorrow said, what about today? Will this be my last chance to try or is it gone? The Lord answered softly, there's another coming on. Though lions roar and people war, you can't keep life at bay. You can't trust luck or destiny, but I am here today. Oh, I said tomorrow, the Lord said today. He said, you can do better, you can be right now and pray. He said, what about today? All ready for some audience participation? <laughs> well, that's awesome. Great. I love doing this song. This is it's an older tune here. I get to sit down. It's, it's perfect. Okay, so can you all scream? Like, <laughs> wow, okay. <laughs> I guess you all can. So this is like a scary, you know, scream kind of song you got to do here. Y'all heard about that infamous gal down in Louisiana by the name of Marie Laveau? <laughs> well, good. <laughs> I, my funniest story for this song is uh, I was playing this song in London, and I asked that question to everybody, and uh, a lot of the folks were kind of like, not sure about Marie Laveau, and uh, so I stopped playing and I said, she practiced the voodoo. And when I did that, my microphone went. <laughs> and then right back again. <laughs> I'm trying to get it to do that every time. I'll have to work on it. Down in Louisiana, where the black trees grow, is a voodoo land. The name of Rilavo. She's got a black tattoo on your bone. Another man done gone. That was unusual. She lived in a swamp in a hollow log with a worn out snake and a three legged dog. She's got a bit on her body and a string ahead. If she ever catch you all a messing around, there she goes. Another man. Gone. Okay. And then one night when the moon was black, we through the swamp, 
Thank y'all. Got a feisty crowd tonight, I can tell. Maybe there will be some dancing on the holidays. Okay, I've um, been changing back and forth here. I think tonight I'll actually give y'all a choice. I have a... used to be my thing to let, you know, let the audience decide. One of my long story songs, if I'm going to subject you to seven minutes or ten minutes of a song, then... Uh, and I thought I'd let you decide. So tonight I'll, I'll give you all the decision. Do you want to hear about a bad girl in Louisiana? Another bad girl. Um, <laughs> ghost pirates or a demon guitar? <laughs> um, <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay. Well, I'm, <laughs> I'm glad we were all of one accord here. Yeah, this is. This is wonderful. <laughs> okay, all in well, all in favor of Bad Girl in Louisiana. Let's hear you. Yeah. Ghost Pirates, let's hear our yeah. uh, Demon Guitar, let's hear you. Yeah. <laughs> Woo! Okay, I, I there is definitely some enthusiasm for that last one. I don't know if there's more of you, but you, you sound a little louder, so. So we'll do Demon Guitar. Maybe we can get to Ghost Pirates on the second half. Sorry, bad girls in Louisiana. You guys uh, failed us there, you know. But y'all are missing out because uh, my Ghost Pirates song, which I'm not going to do, we're going to do Demon Guitar, is <laughs> it, usually I <laughs> Well, what I normally do is, because it's such a long song, it's my longest song. It's about 10 minutes on the album when I recorded it. So... Uh, when I do a live show, what I usually do is just do half the song, and if you want to know what happens at the end, you have to buy the album. So, but, but very recently, um, I had some wonderful folks in Georgia, actually, that, that contacted me prior to the show. They knew that I did that, and they contacted me and said, you know, please, this is important. You play the whole song uh, when you do the show. So I thought, okay, so... About five minutes before the show, I had my phone out trying to read the lyrics because I'd already forgotten the second half of the song. And, uh, but it, it was very important because I had, I had pirates at my show. I mean, I had half the audience was dressed up like pirates. If you guys had dressed up like pirates, then it might have changed things a little bit. <laughs> but I actually know the second half of the song now, so I could actually play it all tonight if we decide to do that. But. Anyway, here we go. Let's do, uh, this is called Sweet Jezebel.
white snow Alligators slink, mosquitoes drink And wild things love to grow It was past midnight, I had one headlight And my gas pedal on the floor I was tired of watching clocks and taking hard knocks And locking my dreams in a drawer of a 
despair all leads me straight into the arms of the light. Oh, but sometimes in the dark I see the eyes of a shark. I'm lost in a dream for a spell. Before I can wake, I eat devil's food kick and I hear again, sweet Jezebel. I hear again, sweet Jezebel. Thank you all. Okay. Y'all ready to dance to some fiddle music now? <laughs> okay. Let's start with a hoedown. I have a feeling that you guys like to dance to very fast music. So this is a, it's a nice fast one. called Arkansas Traveler. It's a good old tune here. Awesome, awesome. I just looked up and caught you there dancing. That's what I like to say. <laughs> well, cool, we're just getting started here. Uh, clearly, the rest of y'all like to dance to Celtic music more, so I'm gonna do some, uh, some Celtic music for y'all. This, uh, this is a little medley of a song I wrote called Dance of the Thistledown. And uh, thank you. <laughs> and two, uh, two classic Celtic tunes, which you might recognize here. Of course, mine's the best of the three songs. <laughs> Thank you. 
time to just uh, one or two more before intermission. And I've done 8,958 steps. <laughs> so I'll tell you what. But, <laughs> that's right. We can get tuned up for this one here. I was gonna do one from the new album, but I think I'll do this one instead right now. I have a new album out, by the way, called Portrait of a Woman. Thank you. Okay. Next year there'll be Portrait of a Woman Part Two, which is uh, is even better than Part One, but you have to buy Part One first to get the full effect. So. Anyway, okay, yeah, and part two also is gonna have a 25 verse song, so we wanna make sure you don't miss out on that one. I'm gonna outdo myself this time. Okay. What's that? In the song? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> that might be a good idea. At least in the live show, I might, you know, call for a bathroom break or something, or you raise your hand if you need to. I'm gonna do this one from my Cold album. This is uh, this is one I really enjoyed writing. I, it's another one I co-wrote with my mom, and she's back there at my merch table. If you haven't seen her, yes. If you all watch any of my uh, you, music videos, you know that she does all the videography for that. We uh, we go out and trick out into unknown places like our last uh for no man's land we uh thought it would be cool to go and shoot in the sand dunes and uh yeah so we uh so i've got my 13 pound banjo along with all this other gear and my mom's got like you know 30 pounds of camera gear and we're marching through the sand we go like it's gonna be awesome we're like we walk in for an hour crawl, you know through all this stuff and we finally get to the location that we want, and then all of a sudden, a sandstorm starts. And it is just blowing so hard, you can't even look at it. And we're trying to like pack up things and get the camera, protect the banjo, and track you know, another hour back to where we started from. And then it was all over kind of by the time we finished that. So. And so were we. We were kind of done for the day. But anyway, the joys of making music videos in exotic locations, right? Okay, so um, here we go. Yeah, this is called Dark Woods. Cold ashes of an old campfire A scrap of cloth caught on a briar Time chose to say, 
song then we're going to take a little intermission here and then I'll do some some from my new album and some Florida songs I uh my oh well, I'm getting chatty here um because you know sometimes people ask me how I got the name Mean Mary because clearly I'm I'm very sweet and kind and wonderful so uh, it was actually from my first original song I wrote when I was about four and a half. I'm the, uh, I'm the youngest of six kids, so we uh, grew up in the panhandle of Florida. And all my siblings were born in Florida, but for me, the, the hospital was across the line in Alabama. So I guess that was worthy of a song. So I wrote a song called Mean Mary from Alabama. And uh, it kind of became my little theme song. Everybody would request it, and uh, the press kind of picked up on it. You know, Mean Mary's coming to town. And I, uh, I retired the song when I turned six. Um, but the name just stuck long after, so what can I say? <laughs> but anyway, so I did grow up around the panhandle. And I've got this, um, we like to write about Florida sometimes. And we, um, my mom and I were also novelists. So we, we, we won the Reader's Favorite International Book Award for Best Mystery Novel and some other awards we've won. And that's kind of, well, anyway, enough bragging for now. I'll just go ahead and do this song here. This is one you might recognize. Well, I got a guy in Tennessee. He's as sweet as he can be. He's got eyes of baby blue. Makes my gun just straight and drew. Going down Cripper Creek, going on our own. Going down Cripper Creek, I have some fun. Going down Cripper Creek, going on our own. Going down Cripper Creek, I have some fun. Well, I got a guy in my look. 
creek, going on for seeing him about two times a week. Test his lips, see does any wine, round for silver, round him like a sweet potato vine. Going down Cripper Creek, going on a roll, going down Cripper Creek to have some fun. Going down Cripper Creek, going on a roll, going down Cripper Creek to have some fun. show off the fact that I have gone. I've gone to uh, nothing better, really, than wireless banjo. so much. We'll be right back for next set. All right, everybody. What did you think of that first set? That was something. I, I really enjoyed that. I'm going to turn it back over to Mary. for some more audience participation. Of course you are, yes. Okay, so um, can you all say, oh boy? So I say, oh boy, you all say, and then you dance. Just putting it up. All of my love, all of my kissing, you don't know what you been. Been here all with me, oh boy. For oh the world to see that you were meant for me. All of my life, I've been waiting. Thank you. 
-hmm. knew you had more in you than just screaming. <laughs> okay, well, I might do this song here. Let's see. This is one. This is one actually on two of my albums. I recorded it on my lone album, and then I also recorded it on the newest album. Because uh, I really wanted you y'all to know that I need a big tour bus. big strange city, another hotel bed, another big strange fly buzzing around my head, another sold out show to a crowd of ten, another sleepless night, then I'll do it again. is done then I'll exit the bar with my pepper spray gun then it's back on the highway another drive in the dark another sleep in the car night oh but this time I'll park my feet on the dash my head on the seat a musician's lap it sure is sweet I know I can't get much for us just a second. Y'all yeah, sure. give it up for, uh, for Eric. He's running sound, doing a great job. So let's see here. What do I want to play? I'm going to do my, uh, my train song. What's that? <laughs> We'll get there. We'll get there. When I want y'all to leave, I'll pull out my 10-minute song and we'll uh, go from there. Okay, this is, uh, this is one I wasn't planning on doing tonight. 
It's one of my older tunes, but you are such a fun-loving crowd that I just can't help myself. Anybody uh, own a barn? Of course, the tractor guy up front, husband. <laughs> Keep your tactics. <laughs> Do y'all like barns? Like big red barns? Okay. <laughs> this is from I Walk a Little Ways with me album. This is one of the uh, one of the first uh, close to one of the first music videos we did. We had a lot of fun. It's a lot more fun with the ducks and chickens and stuff. It's hard to take them on the road some of the time. But anyway, you all are my ducks and chickens tonight. You're going to be my barnyard ambience. Yay. We're so excited, Mary. Yay. Oh, great. This is wonderful. Um, so can you all make the sound like a duck? Wow. <laughs> Hidden talents, I tell you what. We got the audience tonight. I have an um, extremely funny story to me, anyway, on this song that I did. Um, in, uh, in Germany, I played this song. I, um, a few years ago, uh, when I was touring Europe, there was uh, most of the folks in Europe spoke fairly good English, but there was this one venue in Germany that nobody uh, seemed to speak English at all. And I had my phone out, Google Translate, and I was doing an awesome job. So I thought... <laughs> Uh, trying to uh, let everybody know how to uh, that we were going to make it sound like a duck. And uh, I guess what happened was I got so caught up on the word duck to German that uh, by the time I got to the part where I was supposed to quack, I had a whole room full of Germans going, duck, 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 duck. So, and I haven't played the song since. No. <laughs> Here we go. So. Sitting all alone in my big red barn When it ain't in critters, it don't give a darn Singing for ducks Wow <laughs> Short and sweet, though <laughs> And geese <laughs> And chickens <laughs> Oh my gosh <laughs> Are y'all are y'all done now? <laughs> Baying like a hound. Woo! <laughs> and playing like the one, two, three, four, ticket. Scores of chores, scores of yokels and boars, love's never gonna knock on these barn doors. Poor little me should be sitting by the sea, the K I S S I N G, no L U V, no fun, 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 oh, no one who ties, not even one. This big red barn is starting to lean, but I'm sitting here. Like a barnyard queen, roost caved in and the floors rotted through, just held together with cobweb blue. Poor little me sitting there in the dust, no one to help me, no one to trust. Sitting in the shadows, yearning for the sun, no oh, nothing, nix, nail not, zero, zilch, none. This big red barn finally fell to the ground and I packed wild ducks and <laughs> all around so I sold the chickens for a ticket and a new bikini flew south with the geese <laughs> Singing. Oh, no one's seen me. Poor little me, finally sitting by the sea. K I S S I N G. They're getting in line one by one. Oh, he's next. Your 
Lord done. Very nice job. Very musical uh, barnyard animals. Uh, we had many nuances going on. It was very. <laughs> oh my goodness. Maybe I should do my 10 minute song now. Call it a night. <laughs> Goodness. I'm going to do my train song. Anybody on a train? No one? <laughs> okay. I, <laughs> I was waiting for him to raise his hand, but no. <laughs> there you go. Hey, it works for me. <laughs> okay, y'all give me some uh, train sound effects here. Yeah. I, I'm inspired, really. I feel I can, it's going to be the best rendition ever. I can feel it. <laughs> here we go. <laughs> this, is, this is one that I co-wrote with my mom as well. We won an IMA for Best Americana song with this, and it's about a race between an Indian maid and her horse racing against the train, the iron horse. And lately on the fast ending, it's not for sure if my finger pick won't come flying off and hit somebody in the audience. So I just want you to be warned that it's, it's a possibility. <laughs> there you go. Lovers do we rest beneath the summer sun? My dusky eyes, but his so blue, our soaring spirits breathe as one. We blazed our love across the skies, surrender to its ancient force. Until the day he said goodbye and climbed the board, the iron horse. Chested on the great divine, the master of the stronger wheel, the high and hold at the longest Like a blade, I loathe its screaming, smoky cry. How could he leave his hidden inmate a ride like wind and ask him why? I strung my fearless pain and done, I chose my pace and set my course. To catch the steam and on the run, my steed against this iron horse. Divide the best deed and the stronger will, the higher horse and the longer stride. Words lost in the air as it rode its way forever east, and the iron horse's speed
almost. <laughs> Thank y'all. I almost lost my finger pick, but I, I held on at the last minute there. Okay, we're ready for another hoedown, right? <laughs> we have some dancers I saw, so here we go. For years, I toured uh, playing historic music. I used to teach all the old-timey dances, like uh, the Virginia Reel and stuff from the 1800s. So this is what they would have danced to Virginia Reel to back in the 1860s. It's a little medley of Cotton Eye Joe, Boil Them Cabbage Down, and Chicken Reel. In the pale moonlight, they ran out of powder, so they danced all night. There wasn't any girls, so they couldn't dance slow, so they danced a reel to the cotton eye Joe. Chance at which she'd swing a pretty little guy and the boys and play with them cabbage down. <clears throat> now, Farmer Brown's hens couldn't lay eggs, but they really knew how to shake their legs. So, Farmer Brown fed them his best corn meal and they danced their own chicken reel. waltzes I like to do and I'm gonna do this one actually this is uh this is one that Jay Unger wrote it's a beautiful song and a lot of people think of it as a Civil War era song because uh Ken Burns used it on his uh Civil War series his documentary and uh but it's called Ashokan Farewell and it's beautiful
Thank you all. I, uh, I endorse Deering Banjos, which I'm playing the beautiful Rustic Wreath tonight, my custom one. I also endorse um, LR Bags, which is running my DIs, electronics, some of them, and Shub Capos, Cloud Microphones, and I'm, it's my $100 pawn shop violin here, and when I was playing in Oregon, it fell apart. As you see today, that it's, it's not falling apart anymore. So I'm, I'm working on a Gorilla Glue endorsement now. We'll see, see if we can make that happen. Okay, we can, we could probably squeeze a really long pirate song in if you guys. Okay. I'm not going to guarantee that I remember all the words, but... Yeah. Okay, well there we go. I'll just make up some new song here. Continue this up really quick more. Y'all give it up again for everybody that's working here at Focal Point. Eric and the sound, Jeff and all the folks here doing an awesome Awesome job. So after this song, there will just be probably enough time for my encore. We'll just count this as my, uh, as my last song officially. And then you guys know what to do after that. I just want to give you a heads up. So prepare. <laughs> not behaving, is it? Well, it was a 10-minute song. Now it's a... Now we've got 10 minutes of tuning before the song. It'll... <laughs> I wouldn't do that to you. I made a, I made a promise. So. <clears throat> this is very serious now. We're talking about ghost pirates, so we gotta get sexy. The main and red anchor at her last port of call. Jenny ran down the docks and late for the Or a 
plain black mask like a serpent skin. It covered his face from forehead to chin. She could test him. Salt of the sea And his eyes were as blue And his manner as free He said, Ginny, as always You're lovely, my dear As for me, I've aged enough
then slip from his grasp like water through sand. Now the maiden she sails with ghosts on her decks. Shall sail forever this world over next Searching the death below and above But one night a year Jenny dances her Thank you very much. I, um, I did leave out one very important verse, but we'll just move on from there. If you want to hear that verse, you'll have to buy the album to know how the story went. So. <laughs> the one that made it all kind of make sense? Yeah, that was the verse. Um, you get the point. Um, yeah. So... <clears throat> Since y'all insist on a encore. Thank you. <laughs> been a wonderful audience and you have been very good about participating in all sorts of things so I have no complaints thank you give yourselves a round of applause for all your all your hard work this evening I tell you what I'm impressed <laughs> Wow. Well, usually I just smoothly go into the encore but uh, <laughs> tonight's little special tonight. <laughs> well, I live in Tennessee now. We, we, we know all about humid and grown up in... <laughs> Who's going to dance on this last song? I was going to do... Uh, I was going to do something real rock and roll because Jeff said he would lead the conga line at the end of the night, but... Uh, Oh, well. Come along with me. This is my song to invite y'all to come along. I can't quite fit y'all in my Jeep Liberty, so. So you'll have to put you on the roof. I'm just a traveling musician. And life on the road can be cruel. I don't make enough money to be anything but poor, but it's enough to pay for my fuel. I don't have time for long goodbyes. I can play you half of a song. The other half goes with me on the road, but it's a whole song if you come along. You If you come along with me
Thank you so much. Thank you all very much. I appreciate it. I enjoyed St. Louis. Thank you guys. <laughs> 